You cannot... <laughs> That's disgusting. Yeah, I think so. which color I was missing. I knew it was supposed to be 16 colors in total and I had only 15. It was the magenta. And I think actually you will be the magenta sheep. Stand still. Please, we got two perfect, and here they are, collected. We are going to make carpets, and for that we need uh, two pieces of wool each. Uh, so we need to collect the blue one, I won't remember this, brown. Orange, yellow, and uh, lime. Okay, let's see. Memory, work. Did I say orange? Let's share this one. To be safe. Lime, yes. I also took the opportunity to share some black sheep for our floating uh, bridge. Brown, right? Oh, you grow fast. Lime wool. Um, yes. Yellow. Blue brown. And. This should be it. This place is crowded. And uh, brown. Great. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Um, so I'll make some carpets and I'll meet you back at the um, llama pen. So I have prepared all the carpets and now we need to prepare all the llamas um, because we want all the 16 beautiful carpet patterns of course so let's start breeding these wonderful creatures Hmm. What happened? Did you eat my hay bale without making a baby? Hmm. Maybe they need to be tamed before they can be bred. Well, of course, that must be the case. Ah. Okay. Okay, so this might uh, take a while. Okay, I think they are all tamed now, but to not waste any more hay bales, I think I will put on 
um, the carpets first because then we can really see which one are tamed or not uh, because you can't put these carpets on unless they are tamed so let's do that first let's take these beautiful colors and four more yellow and these uh, blue ones so let's see oh oh okay yeah beautiful Um, like that, yes, that's a nice one, two, and the pink one. Okay, that one is a little um, kitschy. <laughs> yeah, but they will look so nice together, all of them, when they are all dressed up like this. It's so nice with the, this blue and yellow kind of uh, Swedish actually <laughs> yeah oh I like that one nice That's fine too. Okay, so I guess they were all um, tamed. So now we should be able to breed them. The question is, do I have enough? I have seven. And let's try and keep the Yes, the uh, the colors together, so that we can have half white and half gray. Oh, can I have a look at you? He's following the yellow one, it seems. Or are you just walking around aimlessly? No, maybe either of the the parents. So you did you eat it? What happened? Uh, and <laughs> okay, you and you. Ah. Mm. So cute. Now let's remember. One, two, three, four. Uh, hmm. I guess they won't take them unless they are um Okay, I guess I have bred your you already. So I saw a heart. So you It's a little strange that you are being sucked into them when you breathe them with the the hay bales. 
um, maybe they like it so much, so they hug you. Yeah, that must be it. Uh, so we have three, three babies. So in a little bit we can dress them up too. And in the meantime, um, I think I will dress up this place because it's all grass, dirt and uh, uh, tall grass at the moment. And I think it needs uh, some stone, smooth stone and cobble. Uh, maybe a little flowers. And actually, I was thinking about sand mixed in too, and maybe some wood. Um, I think I, I'll try to create some kind of palette, and um, I'll be back. No, no, no! What's oh? What happened? How could it suffocate here? There's no half blocks or anything. That baby must have... Yeah, I don't know what happened. Oh. We lost one. Here's a grown up baby. Do we have the other? Yeah, we lost just that one. Okay, I've started to um, try some things out. Um, the sand is, the contrast is high, but if you see, if you look around, there's a lot of this color. Um, we are surrounded by deserts here, so... Mm, I don't know, I will fiddle about with this a little more. Maybe some gravel next to it. I think it's um, it's too little right now of the other stuff so um, but I've tried to you know make make the terrain a little less squarish and uh, not all dirt. Maybe something like that. Maybe. And um, some of these half cobbles in some places. Maybe, yeah, let's see, I will, I will fiddle about some more, uh, but now we have two more llamas, so let's tame them and uh, um, yeah, I could go for the, the carpets right away, of course. Red. I, I want to see red and orange. So it's you with the one that's tamed. Yeah, that's that's really nice. Yeah, I like that one. 
I think that's my my favorite. It makes me hungry. It's the McDonald's <laughs> colors. Okay. Huh? Didn't I see hearts? He just can't decide. Yeah, that's nice too. That's real, um, uh, you know, Perun. Perun? From uh, Peru or something? Actually, I'm not quite sure where llamas live in the real world. Llamas live in one place of the world and alpacas in another, I think. I need to read up about that because my children will ask. Hopefully, anyway. So, we could just try one thing before I go back to my off-camera work and see which flowers. Oh, it's... Yeah, those three, I think. That's nice. Okay. And maybe we'll mix in some more flowers, just for the the nice colors. Um, yeah, so I'll go back to um, my work without pressure, without anyone watching <laughs> at the same time. And uh, next time I think this will be done. Now we have all the 16 carpet patterns and I've done some more work here I think it's um, done now a little shelter for them there for the rain it never rains in this world but anyway um, and a couple of rocks thrown in. I think it looks nice and some hay bales. Um, also some free growing uh, wheat in, in some places. I still like the sand. It's a little contrasty but um, I like that contrast and you can imagine that it has been blown in from the surrounding deserts here. And uh, it also could have come with the llamas as they traveled through the desert to get here. Um, what else? I think that's it. I, I'm satisfied for this time. I think it's... we have a, a cozy stay here, looks like. <laughs> you see this uh, green llama? I was terrified at some points. Look at, look at that pattern. <laughs> it's a creeper. So if you're working and suddenly you see this in the corner of your eye, <laughs> That's kind of scary. So, anyway, thank you for watching this episode. And um, I'll see you next time.